Well, firefighters in Tokyo will soon be better prepared to deal with nuclear emergencies. The city's fire department is introducing a new response unit. The crisis at the Fukushima Daiichi power plant prompted the move. The department currently has four special units for disaster response and rescue. One of them is trained to handle radioactive and chemical substances. Those firefighters went to Fukushima last March to measure radiation and help cool the facility's damaged reactors. The unit deployment left Tokyo unprepared for a possible emergency. The department says forming a second unit will address that gap. About 60 new workers will be hired. The department formed its first radiation squad in 1996, a year after the Great Hanshin earthquake devastated the city of Kobe. If this new plan is approved, it would be the first time since then that extra personnel have been added. An atomic bomb museum in Hiroshima has reset a clock known as the Peace Watch to protest nuclear tests conducted by the United States last year. The clock at the Hiroshima Peace Memorial Museum displays the number of days since the world's last nuclear test. Museum director Koichiro Maeda pressed the button, setting the clock back to 55, the number of days since the U.S. last carried out a test on November 16th. The number on display had been 285, the number of days since a different U.S. test in March 2011. This is the 15th time the clock has been reset since it was created in August 2001 to encourage eradication of nuclear weapons. It's a shame the U.S. keeps such a destructive nuclear weapons arsenal. Hiroshima and Nagasaki must constantly work towards eliminating these weapons. Let's get to the truth about who plays dirty. の文と 1月 あの、特に It's about people, people who lie, and people faced with the agony of telling the truth. Right. People like Kimberly Wells, a television reporter paid to smile, not to think. A few words about a veterinarian who makes house calls on sick fish, or is it aquarium calls? Richard Adams, a cameraman who never learned how to play by the rules. Wait till you get that other room, get that radiation all over that cute little body. Jack Goodell, an engineer who knows too much to tell the truth. In anything that man ever does, there's some element of risk, right? Well, that's why we have what we call defense in depth. And cares too much to lie. No accident. It will start with a tremor in a nuclear power plant. Where it will end will depend on three people. I would say you're probably lucky to be alive. Same for the rest of Southern California. Jane Fonda. 
Let's face it, you didn't get this job because of your investigative abilities. Kimberly, don't fight it. Jack Lemon. There was a vibration. Michael Douglas. I don't know that accident is the right word. Accident is the right word. The China Syndrome. The harder they try, the more resistance they meet. They've got their own security men. Do you hear what I'm saying? Do you want me to make it any clearer? The closer they get, no. the more threatening it becomes. No. The China no. Syndrome. No. Today, only a handful of people know what it really means. And they're scared. Everybody keep your strength! Everybody keep your strength! Soon, you will know. The China Syndrome.